my name is Jen from practicalbydefault.com and today I want to talk to you about overcoming your fears and how it impacts our kids. You know there's a saying if you have children that the ear the walls have ears it usually means that our children are listening to everything that we say and usually the things that we don't want them to hear. But there's another thing about our children they're always watching. If you don't believe me, try to sneak a snack that they know you're not really supposed to have, and all of a sudden you'll have all these little eyes staring at you. <laughs> you know, our children learn from our examples. Uh, for an example, if we say that reading is really important, but they never see us read, they're probably not going to quite believe you. Having ch our children watch us as we struggle and overcome our fears is really important, at least in my opinion. I think it shows them that although we all have fears, that we shouldn't really let those fears hold us back. Today I'm gonna to share with you something that you might not know about me. Uh, I'm terrified of being on camera. Hi. <laughs> about a year ago, um, I never even had a picture of myself as my profile picture. It was my sneakers. And as a blogger, that's kind of a big no-no. See, the point of having a profile picture is so you can connect with the people that you're trying to connect with on your blog or your website or in social media. I mean, really, who wants to talk to a pair of sneakers? They were cute sneakers, but still. It kind of erected like a barrier, you might say. And so even though I knew it was vital that I had a profile picture of me there, I couldn't do it. I hate getting my picture taken. I always feel like I'm awkward or everything that I hate about myself shows up in a photograph. Being on video is the same way except you know now I'm staring at myself as I talk and well hitting record I really kind of wanted to either run away or pass out or throw up. It was terrifying and yet at the same time I really knew that if I could overcome that challenge, that fear, I would be able to connect with readers a lot better. Then, about a year ago, there was a 30-day free challenge. It was run by, uh, it was called Light It Up, and it really helped you. You were able to have a community of people to connect with. You, it was a safe, uh, really encouraging environment and she led you through step by step each day you had something to work on and so it really helped me to build confidence and overcome that fear now mind you I'm still uncomfortable in front of the camera but I'm getting there and my children watched me go through this journey in fact they were usually there not only watching but supporting and encouraging me. They helped me edit videos. Sometimes they were on the other side of the camera making faces at me, which wasn't really helpful, but you know, they felt like they were being helpful. They watched me overcome this fear, and I'm hoping that it inspires and encourages them that even though they may have fears, that they too can overcome them. So now I wanna ask you, do you think it's important for your children to watch you overcome fears no matter what they might be? And how do you think it impacts their lives? If you'd like to leave the answer to that question in the comments, I'd love to hear what you have to say. 